Hey folks, Simon here. Welcome back to Final Fantasy 7 and today we are going to be getting the Great Gospel for the first time actually in my Final Fantasy 7 career. I've never actually collected air into level 4 limit break but I'm going to rectify that today. There is a trophy tied to it on the PS4 and we are getting the Platinum Trophy so it is important. Now, on a previous episode I showed you how you can get access to the Mithril, the item that you are going to need to trade in order to get the Great Gospel. So I'll leave a, a link down to that previous video if you haven't done that already but if you're watching today just make sure you're watching with the mithril in your inventory and you'll also need to make sure that you can use the tiny bronco this little house here that we're going to be heading into is an area you can visit before the tiny bronco but it will be empty the fellow inside that we need to chat to and trade the mithril with will not be present until after you do have the plane so make sure you've gone ahead and got that and then make your way over here you can find it just uh, to the side of gongaga actually and on the same continent of course but with all that said and done simply head inside the house and speak to the fellow inside and you'll first of all probably have to speak to him about the keystone and the temple of the ancients and all of that good stuff regarding the actual story uh, incidentally i don't think you have to speak to this fellow in order to proceed with the game but you just do get this bit of story if you do so anyway once you've gone ahead and gone through all of that then you'll want to speak to him once more and this time he should be able to give you the option to ask about the treasures uh, by choosing the let's change the subject title now once you do that you'll get the choice of two boxes the first which you can see just next to the cabinet that we're standing next to here um, will contain a gold armlet uh, the one that he's opened here but you will have to trade your mithril for that and I don't recommend doing so because gold armlets are very easy to come by whereas mithril mm, not so much now uh, gold armlets can also be acquired by stealing them from the dragon enemy around the the uh, Mount Nibble area. I did a video on that actually, so I won't go over that again. You can also purchase them in Rocket Town. Um, but more importantly, for the Mithra, you're going to want to trade it for the small box that's located on the second floor in the wall. It's kind of like a safe, and that's where the Great Gospel is going to be located. Now, as an interesting side note, Mithril is far easier to attain later on in the game, and you can actually re get it repeatedly in order to eventually get a maximum of 99 Great Gospels. But gameplay-wise, that is utterly pointless. But if you're going for a perfect game, you will want to do that. However, the only one you can get now is the one that's going to be needed to actually teach air with the limit break because when you can get multiple of them later on, um, she won't be around to actually teach her that. So yeah, make sure you get this one. As a side note as to what Great Gospel actually does, it's a fantastic limit break actually, completely overpowered, very broken, uh, but obviously very limited in its use because Aerith won't be with us for too much longer now. And what Great Gospel does is not only fully heal um, the HP and MP of all party members, removes all negative status ailments from the party as well on top of that it makes the entire team completely invincible for quite a substantial amount of time in the battle as well so they do not take any physical or magical damage very very nice it's a free god mode um, once you've gone ahead and learned it but as i say its application is limited because there's not a whole lot of many battles ahead of us now uh, involving Aerith. Anyway guys, I hope you uh, enjoyed the video. If you did, don't forget to drop a like and check out the channel for more videos and I'll see you next time. Goodbye.